depth of the holes is five and a half according to the manufacturer. And what you'll see here is our water porosity it used to be 38 and now it's 31.9 so it's improved dramatically over the, the course of right. since 2007. Our um, air porosity has gone from 11 up to 14, so ideally what we want is 20%. So all the aeration work that we've done in the past eight years mm -hmm. is turning us in the right direction, mm -hmm. and this new tool will certainly help with that. So we're at five inches, so that's pretty good. Uh, the maximum length we can get is five and a half, so once the greens get a little softer, we will get that full five and a half inch depth. Right, right. It's pretty neat. So what's the benefit of doing this as opposed to aerating? Well, the biggest thing is an aeration is a little more disruption to the surface. Right. So if you're actually pulling a core, you might be looking at seven to 14 days recovery time, especially right. at this time of year in these cool temperatures. Yeah. You know, our soil temperatures right now are nine Celsius. Right midday yeah and we'll be putting on these things in two yeah. hours and they'll be perfect yeah. so we still need to top press this yeah skin, exactly and then we'll roll it yeah. and then we should have a smoother surface yeah. than before we started but even without the top dressing and rolling these things are very playable right now they are for sure yeah. that's incredibly fast incredibly fast our, our target green speeds are between nine and ten with nine foot six being a perfect speed for day-to-day -day play if we mow in the morning, uh, we'll tend to get green speeds at 9. If we skip a roll and actually just roll, we can actually get 9, 6. And if we combine the two processes, if we cut and then roll in behind for, let's say, a, a club championship or something, we can gain about a foot of ball roll. Right, a foot. Yeah. We've got a good surface. If we wanted to do one final procedure, we could now mow this just to pick up any of the little fragments of grass that are left behind in the process. But that's a very puttable surface right there. Thank you.